Hey guys, Steve here for the follow-up session. I just wanted to take some time and go over the setup that I used this year for my six-year-old little girl to be able to go hunting and take her first four deer, actually. So, I know this system works and it's something that I think uh, a, lot of, a lot of hunters will be able to use to get their kids involved. She didn't really like the idea of hunting with a gun because I'm a bow hunter, so... She got We got her a crossbow last year and she's been practicing. And one of the first things I noticed was not being able to see what she was aiming at. It made me nervous, it made her nervous because she wasn't sure that she was shooting in, you know, shooting at the right spot. So, made a couple of modifications so that she's able to see what's going on and I can see what's going on where she's aiming. Make sure she's lined up properly so she can take a good ethical shot at an animal and uh, it's worked out well this year so far she hadn't missed a deer she's made good shots every time taking her time didn't rush things so I think we're off to a, a good start with her and I'd just like to show you what all we've done to be able to make that possible we're using the Codwell field pod it's a uh, you know, portable shooting rest, which gives her a good solid rest to be able to make a good clean shot. Um, holds her crossbow perfect. It's very adjustable for different sizes. It also puts it at the right height for her to be able to stand up and to be able to make a clean shot with while being comfortable. I made this... Uh, do-it-yourself phone scope holder which I mean it's really not that difficult it's not much more than a couple of plumbing fittings that you can get at Lowe's I think it cost me probably a total of about six bucks to make this thing and uh, it works very well um, you see you've got a good clean sight picture you can tell where she's aiming or he where they're aiming at and you can also coach them on you know the actual best shot placement for the shot that they're being presented you can also hit the record button and record the, the shot through the phone itself which is nice makes it easy to get a little bit of it on film self-filming um, all it really consists of is a rubber Fernco plumbing fitting, an inch and a quarter, an inch and a quarter plug that goes inside and held by the clamp. And I just got this uh, phone holder for designed for a vehicle and modified it to sit on this rail, which this is a rail that actually came with my camera to hold your... Uh, microphones lights and things like that that's what I had so it's what I used these little red things aren't they're nothing more than washers they're electrical fittings that I had that I use for washers to make sure it fit tightly it's quite adjustable so it'll fit most size phones because of the, the phone holder you get and I mean it's, it's really simple to put together there's plenty of videos on YouTube on how to make your own um, I prefer to make things myself instead of buying them. You can purchase them online, uh, you know, a phone scope holder. Uh, it's just a really good setup for a young kid. It takes a lot of the pressure off with the stand for them trying to hold something heavy like a crossbow or a gun. It uh, seems to be a really good system. Four deer for my daughter and one for my niece this year, which she'd never even shot a crossbow or used this type of setup before the day we went hunting we went outside practiced a couple of times she was dead on so took her set her in the blind and she killed a nice eight point buck using this so it's definitely a good option for somebody wanting to get young children into hunting and i hope this has been helpful hope to see some videos from you and your kids out there going hunting and using this setup hope this helps have a good day